Hello friends, I am Neeraj and I am back again. And uh, I have been receiving your queries. Uh, my inbox is flooded with the main question that is troubling everyone. What to do with the stock market in this time? I know that question is very, very relevant right now. But let me tell you one thing. So I am here primarily to tell you what you need to do in the time of a lockdown. The strategy, we will keep it very, very simple this time. So I'll give you one or two pointers where not only can you take advantage of the stock market, you can uh, grow your knowledge about finance and make money in the market. So there is a saying of thermometer versus thermostat. Thermometer just measures the temperature, uh, whereas thermostat changes the temperature around it, it adapts. So right now the time is to be a thermostat. So don't just sit there, please respond to the environment and make the environment work for you. Make the environment work for you, I am saying because you should make the stock market work for you. Many people are telling me their portfolio is drenched in red ink. Yes, should we stop investing? Definitely no. Many people were like, I wanted to invest in the stock market, but now I'm not investing. I am waiting for the situation to go by. Uh, let me tell you, uh, this would be one of the ideal situations to invest. A simple reason being, uh, usually the stock market has many factors playing in and you never know which sector is going to go up or down. But now from this grey area, stock market is becoming a black and white area. So I for one, I am sure some sectors are definitely not going to perform and some sectors are going to outperform. And that the strategy what I am going to discuss is KISS, K-I-S-S, -S, which is keep it simple, silly. And for this strategy, you don't need any mathematical formulae, any permutation combination. And uh, people who have tried to tame the stock market by mathematical formulae and permutation combination have been eaten alive by it, especially in this time. So the strategy, keep it simple, silly, is this way. Just look around you. You don't need any financial guru giving you advice. No tips from anyone. Tips are for waiters. Just look around. And every time you open your wallet, every time you uh, do an online transaction, see which sector you're buying into. I for one am sure that uh, automobile is not going to grow in the next uh, few quarters, but I am for sure that uh, online businesses are going to grow, telecommunication is going to grow, pharmaceuticals is going to grow. Therefore. If you see housing might fall down, therefore if you see a very clear black and white picture, so you can definitely avoid few sectors. Now which sectors you will avoid, you can just look around you. Just think what you are going to do, because what you are going to do, the entire country is going to do the same way. Therefore if you think that I am not going to spend on luxury items in the near future, I am not going to spend on a new car in the near future, so you should understand that that sectors are not going to perform. So instead of you concentrating on the stock market, you just focus on yourself. See where you are spending, what is your spending pattern. FMCGs for example, you will need them every day now. Uh, invest the same or mirror it in the stock market. Again, like I say in my many talks, don't do it in one shot. Make equal buckets and put little by little, nibble into the stock market. So if you feel that yes, this online sector or this particular sector is doing well, ground level, grassroots level, please go for that. And many people who have uh, invested in March have already seen a huge gain. So I would say more than ever, this is the time to invest. And uh, if you see uh, in the lockdown, we have a new thing called uh, Atmanirbhartha or it is called uh, self-reliance. Now that has helped us in so many aspects, many things that we thought we could not do. We are doing it now. There are so many people uh, who have become Sanjeev Kapoor in the kitchen. Uh, again, it was not tough, just that they did not have that time and energy. Secondly, they always thought someone else was doing it. So this lockdown, take it to your advantage and <clears throat> try to learn some financial jargon every day. Try to watch some videos on the market every day, watch some news channel about it every day. Do it yourself. And I'll tell you, it's very, very easy. You will stop depending on others completely. You yourself will learn so many new things. So the reason that uh, I will wait for my friend, I'll wait for the lockdown to get over, nothing like that. You start 
and you start developing the skills on your own and you will notice very soon that more or less you're getting the grip of it and you don't know how long the lockdown is going to last but even after that it always makes sense to do it yourself because ultimately there is only a little what outsiders can do you are in charge of your own money you are in charge of your own finances how much ever others help you guide you ultimately it's you who has to take the decision whether you have to go from point a to point b and uh, many people uh, have made lot of money also in the stock market in the last one or two months maybe going up or down there is a saying in the market who says the market needs to go up to make money so people have used that that concept is called shorting which i'll be discussing in my later videos so for now just break it down and the main objective is keep it very simple so kiss just look at things around you i'm not telling you to make a lifestyle change i'm not telling you to make a big financial change i'm telling you to be more aware every time you spend something now just be aware in which sector you're spending and the more you're spending realize that sector is booming and please invest in that sector this simple mindset change not only in the time of lockdowns throughout it will help you get money now don't worry about the mathematical underlying at this stage because people are bothered it's anywhere gone out of the window this simple lifestyle change attitude change whenever something goes out of your pocket analyze in which sector it has gone make changes accordingly and very soon you will realize that your individual spending patterns the country the economy is all just multiples of it so ultimately the answer is within you thank you